I know, I know earlier this year you had an overtime game that was scoreless and you lost. So, you know, to get one back a couple weeks later, you got to feel pretty good, especially the way you, you played late in the game. Uh, gave us, you know, took away those nerves. I think because we've been there, uh, we, we wanted that Absagami win so badly. Um, I don't think the guys were going to let this one slip out of their fingers. Uh, plus, there's a little redemption from them eliminating us from the playoffs uh, last fall. So, you know, it was basically our, mo our motivation was to get back in there. And uh, I think we controlled the overtime periods uh, with our possession and, uh, you know, gritty style in the box. So. Did, uh, it, it, you know, that's a pretty physical team. Did you feel like you, you, you matched that physicality pretty well as the game wore on? Uh, I think in, in some positions I did. Um, but, you know, my guys are smarter to go contest that. Uh, we kind of stayed our width from them and uh, sidestepped the tack. So, you know, I, obviously you can't go up against a couple six four kids when you got like five five guys out there playing. But I, I think with our speed and our uh, you know, soccer IQ on some of our players really just kind of outsmarted them with that you know with that brute strength that they were displaying. What uh, you know? How do you think you're? What do you think about how you're playing at this stage of the season overall? I, I think we're playing well, but right now my uh, you know we got some injuries. Mm -hmm. I'm missing a few starters right now. Um, you know, so obviously you know we're doing the best we can, and I'm very pleased on what we have out there. Okay. All right, congratulations. Yeah. Thank